Hello guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to remove the zinc coating from your galvanized steel. The PPE you require will consist of AC lashes, nitro glove, and a respirator. Behind that, I have three jars with water. These first two will be used for the acidic solution and this one will be used for the basic solution. I'll be using some baking soda to create the basic solution and some muriatic acid to create the acidic solution. These will be the two burners we'll be dipping into the acid solution to remove the zinc coating. Please make sure to work in a well-ventilated area as the fumes released from the chemical reaction can cause harm to your health. I turned on the shop's fan to make sure there was adequate airflow in my work area. The acidic solution will be used to strip away the zinc coating and the basic solution will be used to stop the reaction. For the acidic solution, I mixed one part of water to one part of muriatic acid. You can pick up muriatic acid at your local hardware store. I picked mine up at Lowe's. For the basic solution, I added three tablespoons of baking soda to a jar of water, which equates to 16 ounces. As you can see, it doesn't take much time for the reaction to occur. You want to make sure the airflow is pointed away from you and in a safe direction to push away those harmful fumes. The plastic underneath the jars is just as a safety measure in case of an overflow to make sure the spill is contained.
After the first pass around, I could still see some residue inside the pipe, so I decided to repeat the process. For the second pass around, I added another jar of water to clean off the basic solution from the pipe. This helps the acidic solution maintain its potency. The second time around, I incorporated some movement in the acidic solution to create some shear inside the pipe. I repeated the process a third time to ensure a smooth finish inside the pipe. This is a picture showing the inside of the pipe after being treated with the acid. We can see a silver ring towards the back which indicates that's where the acid reached. And before that we can see the rust forming around the walls which is a good indication that the coat has been removed. This second picture shows the outside of the pipe with a clear separation from the treated part and the non-treated part, with a clear black line and the silver shining from the galvanized section. You can see some rust forming on the threads, which again is another indication that the coat has been removed. This concludes this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, leave a comment and I'll try to answer it to the best of my ability. If you found this useful, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe for future content.